Hi everybody from a beautiful early morning here in the Commonwealth. We are in the jewel of the Commonwealth, looking at a new version of Home Plate. This is Slocum Joe's Nuka Arcade. So just so as you know, first off, you need a ton of stuff from the Creation Club. I happen to have pretty much all of it apart from a couple, but I had some spare credit, so um, I went ahead and finished off the requirements. Uh, the other requirements from the Nexus I didn't have, um, so I installed those two. If you have a look at the mod page, there's only a couple, um, and one of them is really useful. I'm super glad to have it. I don't know why I didn't know about it before. Anyway, I'll show you when we get inside. So this is by Stranger Danger, which made me smile, love the name. And um, yeah, let's get in, have a look. So when you first come in here, you come into this area, which is pretty cool. I love this whole idea of having um, a cafe style diner here. I love that whole aesthetic in real life too. So there's a, an antique fridge and uh, bits and pieces. The Slocum Joe's donuts. Yeah, it's cool. I like it. Oh, <laughs> this also made me smile. Now, these little buggers you can't actually pick up and move. So um, I'll probably end up getting rid of a few of them just so that I can actually use the seats and not end up sitting on a gnome's hat. <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, this was cute. I liked it. So just so you know how this thing works, you need the workshop framework mod. And what you do is you, you buy um, this place and do you know what I'd, I actually bought home plate some time ago in my game but when I got here it said it wouldn't let me in it said requires key which I clearly had but I went and spoke to what's her face the secretary she said go away you've already got the key um so that was a bit of a puzzle I had to add it by console but uh, I guess I'm probably not the only person that's ever happened to but if that happens to you then just just console add it how nice is this? So yeah, you'll come in, it'll be completely empty and all you need to do is go to your workbench, uh, just hover over it, you'll get three options. One of them is manage. If you click on manage, uh, then up will come the ability to import the items from this mod, which is exactly what I did. And I did have a couple of missing items. I could have sworn, I mean, I double checked that I had all of the requirements, but I clearly something isn't working for me so i had to add this weapons workbench the cooker uh, and around here in this big utility room the chemistry station and the armor workbench so it's no big deal um it saved me the trouble of decorating this hideous place which i you know it's it's horrible isn't it I have done it a couple of times. In fact, I've done a video on, on doing this one, um, decorated it in my own style. But yeah, it was hard work. It took ages and I really don't think I could be bothered to do it again. So this is really, really cute. There's a power armor station down here. Oh, I didn't put that in very well, did I? I can see it's on an angle. Oh, well, don't look at that. There's also a decontamination arch. Super nice some mannequins lockers etc oh i forgot to oh, the thing i meant to show you <laughs> is this uh the you'd think i'd never done a video before this is the universal workbench i'm not going to click on it because it my workbench now it takes five minutes to open i am so overloaded but this is exactly what it says click on this and you'll get the option do you want it to be a weapons workbench or an armor workbench or a chemistry station you know whatever it does it all so on that basis you really don't need all these other things do you <laughs> you know what i mean you just don't need them at all which is kind of good because this place doesn't have a bathroom that's the back door right there through the staircase up here's your bedroom and when i decorated this i used this top area here as my bathroom so i figure you know what I think I might do that again I'll either switch out this little office there's nothing on the outside added by this mod by the way um, I may well change this little office into a bathroom although I, if I recall that was quite a pain in the A to do um, or alternatively I might this end 
from the door backwards. I might just get rid of this um, and leave in the floor, obviously. But turn this into a bathroom. Ah, who cares? Nobody cares. Shut up, Dark Star. <laughs> anyway, I might put something on at the end about it if I do it. So there's heavy weapons, stands, locker space. It's a very cool makeover. I like the artwork particularly. Yeah, do let me know what you think about this down in the comments. I'd be really interested to know. Do, is this somewhere that you decorate yourself or do you just generally not bother and <laughs> do somewhere else? Because it's a, it's a funny little, almost kind of skanky building, isn't it? You know what I mean? But this really perks it up no end. All right, I'll leave you with a picture of the gnomes and call that the end of this week's video. I will see you soon for the next. Take care and stay safe, everybody. All right, by way of a PS, um, I did come in and do a bit of work and oh my God, it's so much fun being back in Fallout 4 and doing a bit of building, you know? Um, it seems like such a long time since I have. And um, now, whenever I come into Fallout 4, all I can think about is Boston Legal, Denny Crane. I don't know if you ever saw it. I mean, I started watching it like 20 years after it released um, and had really blooming loved that program. Anyway, so here we are set in Boston. Here it is. This is just this very simple loo. I just um, split off part of the bottom, like I said, that I might, and then put in nice clean loo, hand washing station and a shower. So, you know, simple. And now we have a home. I think really I'm just going to leave it like this now and uh, you know probably won't bother faffing about with anything else in here. I, I really like this overhaul. Do let me know what you think about it and um, if you've downloaded it for yourself and I will see you soon for the next one. Take care, stay safe.